Great. Uh, Carl, can you tell us, uh, how, what does this mean to you on a personal level, this announcement here today? Oh, look, it's a significant uh, announcement for the people of the Gulf region, but for me personally, this is my grandfather's country and it certainly means a lot to me to have uh, it formally declared that this is an Indigenous protected area for the Yanua people and the Gulf region people, so uh, a very significant event. And uh, from the Northern Territory Government perspective, what does it mean? Well, what it means, and I said that in my speech, is you know, for governments, uh, land has been a bit, a bit like a jigsaw puzzle. And over the years, the jigs jigsaw puzzle's been thrown about, pieces have gone missing. And today's declaration for government means that a very important piece of that jigsaw puzzle's now in place. It's in place with the determination of uh, the land claims that have been settled here in terms of the Barangay Park, National Park, what it means now is that we can work with traditional owners uh, to piece those bits of the jigsaw puzzle together and a very important piece today has been formally declared. So a very important and significant event. How long is it going to take to start that joint management with the National Park under this uh, new arrangement? Well it's probably started six years ago. Um, the, the draft plan of management for the park um, and the IPA has been discussed for about six years. So I think, you know, in terms of timelines, uh, we've always known this has been Yanua country. Uh, people aren't going anywhere. Parks are here. We've got a permanent presence here. So, you know, very, in the very near future, what it means is that we'll have a formal plan of management uh, linking in the National Park with the IPA. Yeah, can you just uh, reiterate what you said earlier today about the, the connection with the National Park and the joint management? What does that all mean? Well, what it means is that the park's not sitting on one side or inside an Indigenous protected area with no plan of management. What it means is that the, the two will work together. The two will work in terms of the aims and objectives of the Yanua people and the vision that the elders set out many, many years ago. So uh, a plan of management that will incorporate a national park and the Indigenous protected area, and that plan of management will uh, tell a lot of stories.